I'm Hannah Vatan for Brandon this morning. Thanks for joining us. Well, our top story today, the world's top ranked golfer is in trouble with the police after an incident at the site of the PGA Championship. Happened early this morning. Dan Godwin joins us in the studio with what we know so far after the arrest of Scotty Scheffler. Yeah, Lauren, this would qualify as a strange story. There are still, of course, some questions about what transpired between Scotty Scheffler and the arresting officer, but we may be getting a little better idea. Now, we do have some video of Scheffler walking onto the course about half an hour ago at the Valhalla Golf Club in Louisville, Kentucky, where the PGA Championship is being played. Scheffler scheduled to tee off this morning at 9.08 our time, so in just a few minutes, the tournament tournament started yesterday. Scheffler had a, a good first round. He's five shots off the lead. Now, this is the mug shot from Scheffler's arrest this morning. He was booked at 628 our time for second degree assault of a police officer, third degree criminal mischief, uh, disregarding traffic signals and reckless driving. This is video from where the arrest occurred. There was an accident near the country club where they're holding the golf tournament. Police say a pedestrian had been struck by a bus and killed while the pedestrian was crossing the road. In the aftermath, traffic was backed up in both directions with dozens of police vehicles flashing red and blue lights. Near the club entrance, officers say Scheffler drove his SUV past a police officer. His SUV had markings on the door indicating it was a PGA championship vehicle. That officer then screamed at him to stop, grabbed onto Scheffler's vehicle until it came to a stop. A source from ESPN said police pulled Scheffler out of his SUV, then pushed him up against it, placed him in handcuffs, and then put him in the back of a patrol car, and he was taken to jail. Just just moments ago, ESPN reporter Jeff Darlington posted this statement that he says Scheffler gave to him. It says, quote, this morning, I was proceeding as directed by police officers. It was a very chaotic situation, understandably so, considering the tragic accident that had occurred earlier. And there was a big misunderstanding of what I thought I was being asked to do. I never intended to disregard any of the instructions. I am hopeful to put this to the side and focus on golf today. This morning's round at the PGA Championship was delayed for an hour and 20 minutes because of the accident and rain. That meant Scheffler would be able to make his assigned start time. Scheffler, of course, grew up in Highland Park, still lives in Dallas. His wife gave birth to the couple's first child earlier this month. He is looking to become the first golfer since 1960 to win golf's first two majors of the year. He was, of course, this year's Masters champion. Lauren and Hannah, back to you. All right, Dan, thanks.